All right, and we are back with more Simon the Sorcerer. Okay. Brought to you by GameAnyone.com, and we're trying some magic here. Holma. Gaza. Wow, check out the new threads. Hmm, not bad. Not bad at all. I nearly forgot. All magic relies on colors for it to work properly. If you get stuck in a magical place, try thinking about the colors you can see. Okay. I assume that will be relevant at some point. All right. Now I'm styling. I'm either wearing black or navy blue. I can't really tell. Let's see. Where's that wizard bar? I don't see it at all. There we go. It's closed. Alright, maybe it'll be open in the morning. Bloody hell. Fashion wizard. Bah. Fashion magic. Ooh, de lolly. Man, that cheese wedge has been very effective at holding that door open for hours. That is some tough cheese. Yeah, it's definitely black. Black robes, not navy blue. Compared to the blue jeans, it's diff it's black. Sleepy time. Wakey time. I keep forgetting I don't have to open my door to get out of my room. I just thought of something. As long as I'm at my room, I might as well... I didn't close my door. What is that? There it is. That is exactly what I thought it was. They can't even animate some smoke. Seriously. I hope they don't try to bill me for burning their blanket. There we go. Now he's finally opened that window. It's not relevant at the moment, but hey. Let's head to that wizard club. See if we can't find Tubby McChubkins. It still appears to be night out here. I bet it'll be yeah, it's day once it lo once the screen loads. Lol, day night transition. Lol. Uh, 
Unless I run the wrong way, it's probably faster just to run down the street, yeah. Knowing me, I'm running the wrong way. Probably. Nope, I ran the right way. Alright, now where's Chubsy Ubsy? Hi, I'm looking for a guy named Porkins. He's about the size of a small house. Smells like a chip shop fryer. Porkins just left for the blue room. Thanks. Blue. Have you seen Porkins? Porkins just left for the white room. Ta. White room. Have you seen Porkins? Porkins just left for the blue room. Ta. Bloody hell, he's just leaving on us. Fooled you by going back to the white room. Hail Porkins. Aha, there you are. I thought you might be coming. I'm an official wizard now, and I need a favor of you. What kind of favor? Well, I need to get out of the city, and Calypso told me you could get me some papers to get past the guards. Hmm. Normally that wouldn't be a problem. Anything for a fellow wizard. You scratch my back and I'll enjoy it, and that kind of thing. Well, I doubt you could scratch your own back. Yes, well. Unfortunately, when I was walking over here, one of those street urchins stole my magic quill. And? And without it, I can't make you any papers, I'm afraid. Hmm. Can you improvise with a biro? Of course not. The quill has the power to imitate any form of writing. Without it, there is no way that what you ask can be achieved. Bummer. Who did you say stole your quill? There's a gang of child thieves in this town led by a young rogue known as Billy, Billy the, kid. the Kid. They've been pestering innocent people for months with their jolly songs and pickpocketing antics. It was quite quaint at first, but now it's become a downright nuisance. Where can I find them? If I knew that, I'd have gone after them myself. But they disappeared down a sewer grill and it was simply impossible for me to follow. Kind of like banging a fat round peg into a small round hole. Listen, kid. When you've been a wizard as long as I have, you'll soon learn the importance of size. Magic comes from within every cell in your body. Wow, you must be really powerful. I am a wizard of the highest standing. And the lowest center of gravity. I agreed to help you, young man, but your attitude disturbs me. You should show me some respect, or it will be your undoing. Sort of like Captain Ahab and Whale. Precisely. This is just typical. I'm sorry, but that's the way of it, I'm afraid. If you get my quill back for me, I'll certainly do what I can for you. I'm off to find that quill. Don't move too far. There's not much danger of that. Not without some kind of lifting device, anyway. I assume this is how I get out. 
I want out! Let me out! Hoorah! I have it skyped. Now it's time to go find the street starfish. Urchin, whatever. This way looks all sealed off with fences. Gigi, puppy. Dog missing legs. Did I just acquire a cat? I did. It's a differentially able dog. Sounds like fun, but probably a little cruel. Sounds like fun. <laughs> I meant distract him with the cat, not do anything bad to the cat. Seriously, dude. You have problems, Simon. Out the wazooties. That dog scares me. We're not as far along as I thought. We got plenty of time left. Trainer? Sneaker? <laughs> yeah. Shoo, 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 shoo. Everything that is not a shoe is showing up in my inventory. There we go. It's a differentially yes, able yes. dog. LOL I now have a shoelace I can and this is quite an amazing match we've seen here today Dominated most part by the new defender Josh Tyler He yet to come up against the star striker young Billy Golden Boots Gates Who has surely met his match in Josh Tyler okay. Or is it the other way round? I would say there's only one man on the field Hello you raggedy little street urchins who are you calling raggedy, mister? Well, look at the state of you. Your clothes are all ripped and everything. I ripped them on purpose, because it's cool. Especially in the winter. You're so not cool. Dressing up like wizards is not cool at all. Yeah, you look stupid. Like a girl. <laughs> How about we turn him yeah, pink? girl. What's wrong with girls? Girls smell, and they give you diseases. Everybody knows that. Cool. I'm really skill. <laughs> he said he's skill. <laughs> yeah. What's wrong with that? I'm really skill. And ace too. Skill means you've got bum disease. And ace means you're a crap effort. What? I bet you're pretty rad as well. Uh no. <laughs> he's not rad. Not rad people have really problems. You're just making this up. No, we're not. Everyone knows. Well, I don't. That's because you're stupid. Non-rad, skill, ace, girl kisser. Let's kill them. You young tykes have a lot to learn about the fairer sex. <laughs> you said S-E-X. Yeah, you're so immo. Only immo people say that. Immo? Yeah, 
immature, only stupid people don't know that. Stupid people like well, ones who can't big, spell? Yeah, ugly, smelly little boys say immo. Then you should say it then. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think we can agree on that. And that's the one who's wearing all the Canadian cast magic football boots, worn by all interdimensional players. Jerk faces.